Craven's dead. We'll manage. How exactly? You'll see when the time comes. You could stand to be nicer sometimes. I suppose. But then I wouldn't be the woman you fell in love with, would I? My, my. That must be Morgan. A bite. Just one morsel. One piece. A crumb. Food. Food. <coughs> Shite. Not, not again. Not again! He doesn't seem happy to see us. Wait till he gets a closer look at me. So, where shall we start? Let's go to that tree the sisters mentioned. Plan to bleed yourself for the goddess? Not necessarily, but Craven did. We just might pick up his scent. Craven was here. Look, the impression. Kneeled down on one knee and cut himself to make the offering. Bloodstains, see them? No. I may be inhumanly beautiful, but I don't have superhuman senses. Not like you. Which is why you should stay up here. No offense, but in that undergrowth and mud, it'd be like a... Ball and chain? Plan to say it gentler, but yeah, that's basically what I had in mind. Fine. We'll do as you say. If the need arises, I can cast spells from up here. Thought you might object. Me? Please. I can be extraordinarily conciliatory. Yen, look me in the eye. What are you plotting? Many things. How to seize the Temerian crown, how to sell Cam Morin out from under you. Go already! Craven's blood, flowing profusely, trails clear. Should lead me to him. Light prints. Craven trod carefully. Victims. Strange. Is it Craven? No, this one's been here a while. What? I can't hear you. If you want to chat, come closer. Her senses are really dulled. Monster tracks. Running. Chasing something. Looks like Morgafog got bored of sneaking around. 
and attacked. I like that silver. Blood. Craven's blood. Door won't budge. Craven must have blocked it, or it's just locked. Gotta go round. that. Gotta go down, provided I can open the sluice. Mechanism looks pretty standard. One lever to choose the sluice gate, the other to work it. Lots of prints. Old end. Where's the key? All I have in the chapter house. The crate, but the key. Where's the key? Ah! Why so silent, Robert? You thief, you rogue, you uh, uh, horse son, you uh, worthless bastard! I will find the key without you, <laughs> idiot, stupid prick!
Okay. I will. The curse <laughs> makes me bite, uh, scratch, mangle, uh, till I drop. Uh, you've got time before the blood's gone from me and, and I return. Listen uh, uh, carefully. Uh, undo, undo the curse. Uh, free me. Uh, finally, I will, I will reward you. So, no joy in being a werewolf? Nay. It's the worst. Not the garden to which I'm bound, even. But uh, the hunger, <laughs> anything I devour returns to ash. Ash, I cannot eat, I cannot drink, yet I bloody live and roam and prowl. <laughs> the hunger is terrible, ah, terrible. I bite my own flesh, but the smallest morsel burns my throat like boiling tar. Everlasting hunger, classic as curses go, goes to explain why all those corpses went untouched. Help, or I'll return to shred you, rip you limb from limb. See what I can do. See and do, or I shall return. Looking for a man named Craven. Apparently came here to kill you. Seems <laughs> it didn't work out. <laughs> Those who come <laughs> rarely introduce themselves. <laughs> what did he look like? <laughs> uh, no idea. Then I cannot help you. Uh, I've shredded uh, uh, Benny. Uh, uh. Tiresome conversation. Not interested. What will you do? Uh, what a witcher ought to.
floodgates open, but nothing's happening. Park broke through this door. Must have smelled something beyond it. Symbol of Freya. Untouched. No sign of feeding. Mark Fogg doesn't devour his victims. Strange. Starting to envy you. Wish to hear a story. If I have to, I'm all ears. Warriors came. They knew they could not kill me. So they laid a trap. Chained me down. Lock me in here! Know what I did? I bit my leg off to free myself. Every bite brought pain and howling. I vomited blood. Mm -hmm. Biting off your own limbs hurts. Who would have thunk? You don't understand. This was more. My mouth burned like swallowing fire. As if all inside me was torn. Felt I would die, but I I did it, and then I shredded them, dashed them to bits, made tiny crumbs of those plowing heroes. Your story have a point. We're just doing some chest pounding. The moral is... You cannot kill me. You cannot stop me. I'll not be bound. Break any fetters! The curse. Free me, or uh, I'll return uh, to get you uh, again! Uh! How long are you gonna make me wait?
on, come closer. Mentioned a reward of some kind. Looted. Raided. Drunk most away. All but one. 
Truth, treasure. Head away. Yours. Just help me. Have a bite of this. Ought to lift the curse. Better be true, or I'll rip you, shred you. Ah! What? What did you do? That was your own flesh. Far as I know, curse doesn't allow for that. Ah! Or son, you tricked me, deceiver. Ah! Hardly. Wanted me to lift the curse? Well, you're welcome. Looks like rain. lead to the well. Guess Craven didn't want to be eaten, preferred to drown. The roots. Wet under yen. Hey, can you hear me? Get out! That's scary. Sorry, didn't mean to. I hope not. Let me know once you find Craven. Princesses. No signs of violence. Must have died of hunger. Craven is good. Damn. Dead. Has been for a while. Yen, found him. And? And I've seen rot fiends in better condition than this. Shit. Fine, scrape together what you can and haul the bits up here. Take it you've got a plan? No, I just like to stare at rotting flesh. We'll talk when you get here, all right? That's Yen, charming as ever. Come on, someone wants to meet you. <laughs> Putrefaction set in. But the vocal cords are intact. We might still get something out of him. Doesn't look like the talkative type. Anyone can be made to talk. Even a corpse. One must simply know how. Thought necromancy was strictly forbidden. So is premarital sex. But I'm not about to be bothered by such foolishness. Need any ingredients for the spell? Hmm. The blood of a newborn, a virgin's tongue, and the eye of a newt. Mind trying again without the sarcasm? I don't need a thing. I'm a sorceress, not a village herbalist. All I need is energy. A great deal of energy. We're very lucky this place is saturated with magic. It's also considered sacred. Priestesses will be furious if you use the garden's power to revive a corpse. All the more reason to get it over with before they realize what's happening. Let's get to work. Selene, Selene, Dufrain. Selene, Selene, Davidar. Ha <laughs> 
Are you Craven of Lofferton? No, I... Looking for Siri, ashen hair, green eyes. Have you seen her? She, she's wise. She, she cursed me. I don't care about that. What happened to her? What was she doing here? Speak. No. Speak. Siri. Zirel. Can you hear me? I can. I must leave you now. We will meet beneath drowned dead rock. Can you remember? Mm -hmm. Repeat it. Drowned dead rock. You're awake. And I thought you'd... Where... where am I? And who are you? It's all right. You're on Hindersfjall, village of Lofoten. They call me Skjall. But... how'd I... what? We fished you out of the sea. Me and that friend of yours. Help... help me stand. I... I don't... I don't think you should... Less talk, more giving me a hand. Ah, that's me brother for you. Out of sight for a second, and he's already put his paws on a girl. Astrid, you're as dim as dishwater. You know perfectly well I'm helping her up. It's a shame, I know, but I've got to interrupt your courtship. Come, we're off to the sauna. Where? Why is your mouth agape like you're noodling for an eel? The sauna. Girl, you was blue as a whale when we brought you in here. Your blood needs thawing. I'm sorry, but I must get to Drown Dead Rock as fast as possible. I shan't force you to stay, but the rock's a ways off and you can barely walk. You best take a horse. True. Skjall can prepare a horse for you. You'll have to wait a spell, but even so, you'll get there faster than on foot. Fine, that'll do. Thank you both very much. Pish posh, there's no need. Now come, we gotta sweat the sick out of you. Where are my clothes? I've taken them already. Come on. That man in the mask. <laughs> 